hello youtube i hope everybody's doing great today i want to show you my gsm gps tracker in action so this uh, is was designed to run continuously and the battery is merely a backup but <laughs> that was my cat outside the window uh, the battery it can run on battery as well uh, it's a CR123 battery, rechargeable. Uh, these little guys. Uh, sorry about the light. I have light coming in the window. And anyway, I have here my test unit strapped up. And it has a GPS lock, as you see. And this is my wife's phone that I'm using to demonstrate it. So first of all, uh, it runs. It's a two uh, G network uh, SIM module. Um, the tracker has the following features: it has a button that you can press, and it will send you the location. That's for testing purposes, if you so will. And here you have received the. Uh, location including a map link to the map oops oh. so if you click the link it will open google maps um, don't mind the language that's turkish because my wife is using her phone in turkish so anyway you can of course also <coughs> Excuse me, I have a frog in my throat the whole day. You can send a message, like it has also an output that you can use. Output on. Sending the message. And it will turn on the blue LED over here. It has also another output pin that you can use. And then you will get a notification email that the output is on and then obviously you can turn the output off to f is enough and it will turn the output off and send a notification that is off and then you can also query for the location get location and then it will send you the obviously location And here it is, again with the Google link that you can touch and it will show you the location. And yes people, that's my home, that's where I live. But don't worry. Oh, okay, <laughs> actually, <laughs> um, it has also another feature with the alert object is out of fence. Uh, it is currently set up for 30 meters and if you could see the serial monitor it actually went over 30 meters and then it sent a alert for location and the nice part is oh my back's getting hurting uh, the nice part is once you turn on the tracker it get after it gets the first uh, look um, fix for the location it uses that location as your starting point so you can take it anywhere turn it on as soon as you get the fix the green LED blinks it sets the location and then after the ooh, the max distance is uh, over überschritten <laughs> uh, it once it gets over the max distance it will send you an alert message again with alert objects outside the fence with again a location for your oh where the tracker is 
so this is and i always forgot to mention that feature so the location the base location is not um hard coded in the code because that would be limited unless you want to use it that way but this way whenever you turn it on it gets the first fix it uses that location for as your base and then it, if it goes outside the fence it sends you an alert and i think uh this was it actually shorter than i thought but um oh what i also want to say let me pause the video and i will continue one second okay here we go again so this is it up close can't get it to focus right so it is it has a connector type c connector which charges the battery and also uh, you can use it as a communication for your pc and to upload code obviously so it has this usb to serial chip it is based on the atmega 328 it has an external antenna you can also use uh, with a small connector here use a smd antenna if you don't want to have it stick it out and what else do we have we have the on off switch it has several inputs outputs it also has an input for an accelerometer so technically it could be used well i will use it in my car for example and as soon as it would sense uh, impact or something like that or movement it will send out again uh, an sms it could technically also call you um, there are actually the four pins that you have down here where you could connect a speaker and a microphone and then you could use it as a phone as well obviously and um, it also has here down here two inputs for an external battery if you do not want to use a cr122 or want to use a bigger battery and uh, what else it also has a notification led up here that does light up when it sends and receives messages or phone calls and uh, what else i have two switches currently only one button is used and uh, well, i hope you can see this because the light is pretty let me try to that sounds nice anyway and the gps module used is the l a d dash r and the sim 800 l sms module and uh, this is oh it has well this one is for a customer of mine he actually ordered three of them it has the third one and it also has a connector for an OLED display so you can have also the location or the coordinates display on the display on the display yeah so this one i built for myself i made it a little different i made it modular so i can try the several modules before soldering them down and uh, as well oh another feature i forgot to mention it also has a micro sd card so you could use it for logging as well not only tracking but for logging and these have the micro sd card slot as well a little hard to see but it's there believe me and so you can use this uh, any way you like and uh, adam you hear me when i say this i do like the external antennas it just reminds me on the first cell phones and like this eric sony ericsson phone and the uh, star tech which the which i'm the motorola star tech which i still have unfortunately doesn't work but anyway i mean you can't make any calls anymore it still works 
and uh, anyway i think this is it if you're interested please let me know and um yeah Oop, i just got an alert that it's outside the fence because obviously i'm inside and uh, it has a location but if it goes outside the 30 meters of course you can change that in the code how far you want it but my customer wanted 30 meters so that's what he is getting but anyway i want to thank all my supporters um, be it by patreon or by visiting my banggood affiliate link or buying something from my tinder store I will put these up on my Tindy store as well. And uh, if you do have any questions, leave them in the comments and I will answer them. Thanks for watching and take care everybody.